the earliest one I can think of is Condor, which yes, is in Riverview, the Terrace. Seven. And we started that, well, I was working from the Southport office, so it's, it was probably started in about late 72 right. or 73. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. How tall is Condor then? Around 20? Oh, I know, it'd no, be, be 30, 33, I would oh, think. I don't, I couldn't, I was thinking yeah, about yeah, it this it would morning. Be I'd be 30 plus level. Yeah, again, okay. it was a very big building. But, you know, they, I remember the publicity that they put out when they named it. It was a soaring building and the Condor is a big eagle type yes. bird that soars around South America. Yeah. And so how long were their roles in that one, do you recall? No, I, I, I set everything out in the, on the, uh, in the ground, in the basement. I didn't do any verticality on that one, they were still transferring it with um, spirit levels from floor yeah. to floor. Yeah. They were having their troubles and we, we started, I think the next one we did, we were called in to do the verticality. And I set out the piling in the river for the River Marina to see. And I think there's probably a seabed lease plan. And the building units plan at the end of it. Okay. Mm. Well, the whole box and dice as well. Oh, yeah. the mm. sweet case. Mm. Mm. Okay. There was a, an interesting title adjustment on that one. It's a riverfront lot. And we had to, um, I think from memory, do a right line survey on an agreed river boundary. Mm -hmm. So it was fixed. It's a long time ago. It sits underneath the thing. The structure goes out over the top of it. And no, now it no, not no, no. It goes no. out into the river and the the marina. Yeah, it does. But the tennis court sits on top of that, or something, or something sits on top of it, a car park or a tennis court. It, it, that probably right. probably dates later than I, my involvement with the building. So. I just look at it and think, how the hell you'd never get away with that these days. That's no, all I look at it when I go driving. Yeah, yeah. They. Uh, did funny things with the penthouse arrangement in that one in that the, uh, the partners had some sort of a, a, a take on the, on the penthouses and after about six months they wanted to change the foyer, improve the foyer and they were quite indignant when I said no you've got to go to the body corporate because it's common property. <laughs> <laughs> they didn't want to do that, they were used to operating fairly autonomously. And, uh, they said, but it's only lines on the plan. I said, yeah, that's all right, but <laughs> it is a registered plan. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, you can't change it without the consent of the body corporate. So I've forgotten what the outcome was, whether they actually controlled the body corporate or just didn't alter the boundaries of the common property.